Let's not get carried away. Oh, okay, maybe a little. Because there's a lot to love at Milby these days. I really want to get experience from my high school. I want to have a story to tell my children that we made it a playoffs for basketball, that every team was successful. Milby opened its doors in 1926, and there have been several proud moments throughout the school's history. It's the home of former Green Bay Packers wide receiver Donald Driver, and the boys' basketball team has won two state championships. But rarely has there been so much success dealing with girls' activities. The soccer team is vying for its fifth straight playoff berth after never reaching the postseason. The swimming team is the reigning district champ. The volleyball team made the playoffs for the second straight year. And the basketball team is in contention for the playoffs, all after lengthy dry spells. The Charlie's Angels dance team and the cheerleaders are competitive as well. Cheer-wise, we have we had a great football season, really fun, a lot of energy. Uh, we also placed second in our recent Lone Star Classic competition. It was a lot of fun. Um, I, we love going out there with our girls and doing what we got to do, supporting our team. You know, and then to bring something back for our school, like a trophy, it's, it's awesome. Blue and go. I'm very proud because I mean we practiced hard to get to district, and we're gonna do it again, hopefully. Hard work has been key. Moving to 4A has helped in some cases. Committed coaches and the experience of some recent success have also made a difference. Added up, and the results have left a positive mark on the school. Now that we've learned to love our school and to support our school, I think it helps the body, the school body, to help us motivate each other. The Milby Girls programs, this week's Chevy Spotlight.